Welcome to the vlog. So I've got some really incredible news and it's all about cleaning up places like this. Now I can't run that, I can't run the water as much as I'd like to think. I am, <laughs> oh gosh, I'm going to stop that conversation right now. Look, I can't clean up by running. I need something to do that with and I've been gifted something incredible by Job Sports and I just want to just sort of share that story today as well as the banana story. In fact, I was just running at the traffic lights here and then uh, a father with some kids came up to me and said, were you dressed as a banana yesterday? You were a big attraction. So I've got two stories to tell you, but I'm going to get out of the wind and I'm going to do the unboxing, an unboxing video of what I was gifted by Joe. <laughs> Hey, so we're a little bit out of the wind here so I can talk. We've probably got some cars going on, but I'm gonna shrink myself down so I can do the unboxing. So, this is what I've been gifted by Job Sports. All links are below. Uh, thank you so much, Job. It's just incredible what you've done. And uh, I just wanna tell the story of that. But first, why do, you know, how do I get gifted these things? What is the sort of the thoughts behind it? And, and I just wanna make sure that people realize that this is not just about me getting stuff. It's about me getting stuff to do stuff. Um, so I have a, a rule in the family. So we've sort of decided on that rule together um, that all of the, the work that I do on Instagram, the plogging um, and, and sort of the cleanups and uh, etc., that just costs me so much time. So as you, know, as you probably know, the, the movie, posters, uh, movie posters I do each week cost me around eight hours. So on a Saturday, every Saturday. So yeah, it just costs me so much family time. So I've made a rule with the family that it will cost family time, but not family money. So um, anything that is going to sort of be of use to me in my in my plogging, etc., I try and get gifted. So that's the reason why I've got all these sponsors, Brooks and sort of House of Marley. Yeah, I, I don't have the, the cap and the, and the glasses, but I'm working on it. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I'd love to have just be completely splashed in in brands. That's it's not with a view to say, yeah, look at all the free stuff I've got, but just to say these are supporting me in my efforts. So how do I do it? Well, I reach out to them as simple as that. I just say, look, this is who I am. I usually reach out to them on Instagram and say, look, I'm genuine. I'm really not after it for, for the for the for the gifts. I'm after it so that we can sort of work together and hopefully do something good. You can help me sustain what I'm doing. Uh, I don't get paid for anything, so, but just them gifting me items means that it really helps me sort of, yeah, not spend family money. And I've got some, uh, and it's been a bit of a perfect storm this week. So we've got this paddle board that you can see unboxing. So you, we've got this, I've got this paddle board from Job and I've got something else coming next week. So I've got this perfect storm for something special, but more about that in next week's vlog. So that's the story behind it. So, so I reached out to, to Job, but why did I reach out to them? Well, last year I did a cleanup uh, with Submission and uh, the first time I've ever been on a paddle board and it was just so much fun so much fun and I saw a real benefit not just in terms of cleaning up areas I can't normally get to in the water but also to to work on my core and stability as a runner so I see this just and I see this benefit not just for cleaning up but also for me as a runner and also I don't like to take a day off because I get stiff at my age I get a bit stiff uh, if I take a day off so this will help me do something other than running on sort of in effect a, a sort of a rest day for a normal person for a younger person for me it's an active recovery day so it's going to really help me in that and so hopefully you're going to see sort of lots of videos and uh, stories on Instagram and sort of adventures on the paddleboard in unusual places perhaps like this places that normal paddle boarders don't go in the center of town but I can go to these areas now and sort of do some cleanups on the water there so that's the intent behind it so so I reached out to uh, so I was originally trying to get gift uh, to uh, win a paddle board that was my original intention yeah just sort of enter every giveaway I could find and do it but it just wasn't happening I finally took the plunge and I reached out to Job. And what I like to do is reach out to one company at a time, and uh, if I can, sometimes timing doesn't allow that, but I think it's a better respect to say, look, I'm reaching out to you, I'm not reaching out to anyone else, and hopefully they will sort of say no, yes, or if they ignore me, then a couple of weeks later, I'll, I'll uh, just move on to the next one. So that's the idea behind it. But So Job was the, sort of the first one that I sort of decided, okay, after, no, I'm not gonna win one, that I'd reached out to. So 
I reached out to them and they were so enthusiastic uh, to the point where they've gifted me so much. I just wanted a paddleboard and they just really gifted me so much to sort of really make it such a special sort of package. Um, just to emphasize on that, I only want stuff that I'm going to use. So for instance, they said, do you want an electric pump or would you rather have this sort of handheld uh, triple action space shuttle pump? And I said, look, the electric pump is brilliant but it's not something i will use so i'm better off with just having like a super duper hand pump so um so that's a good example of yeah i'm not just going to get stuff for the sake of it um and emphasize i don't get paid for any of this so uh, all of these are my own views and thoughts so but they really stepped up they give me so much as you can see in the unboxing and 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 wow it was so much fun to use uh, the biggest compliment i can give is i didn't fall in <laughs> So I didn't fall in for the first time sort of doing it. Uh, I'll show you the video in a second. Uh, and the other thing was someone said, someone was trying to stand up for the first time on their paddle board. And someone shouted out to them, look, look just try on Paul's board. It's a lot more stable. So, so obviously got the right board. So the details are all below for the board I've got, etc. But yeah, Joe, you are. You are true heroes. You are really supporting me on my mission, and and the enthusiasm that you've given that you in the conversations that we've had uh, has just been incredible. So thank you so much. Right, so we're going to show the video how I got on with the paddle boarding now, and then after that, I'm going to tell you about the banana suit. <laughs> okay, run BT. So there you go that's the uh, the paddleboard in action my first paddleboard <laughs> so cool thank you so much to to joe for donating that to gifting that to me so kind and uh i think this is gonna be a long-standing friendship i'm just gonna use the heck out of it and get a load of water cleaned up so expect to see those sort of hopefully on a weekly basis i don't know i have to sort of figure out what happens in the winter time but yeah definitely at the moment it's going to be once a week so check out my stories and posts on instagram what it, what is beautiful is it's going to give me that respite so for instance for today um my legs are just tired it's just so much running i've been doing recently and what i like to do is six days of running maybe and then I can sort of get longer distances per day and so seven days a week and it's just been building up building up so the paddleboard is going to give me that core strength chaining but also active recovery and give me give my legs a little bit of a chance to recover so yeah i'm really excited about that anyway thanks joe so let's get on to the banana so what's the story here so uh yesterday i did the the plog x which is the group plogging that i organized starting from a running shop my favorite running shop in harlem run x and what we do is we sort of just do a 5k route i always like to use music um on these runs on these plogs and sort of disco music because it just really gets everyone happy everyone is happy everyone sort of looks up all the people the pedestrians look up and they see what's going on they can hear disco music and you can see them smile so it really engages with it and it makes the impact that much greater so disco music is the perfect sort of music that you can do for something like that uh, just to engage and great create more awareness and a bigger impact but a banana suit 
that takes it into the atmosphere oh my gosh <laughs> that was crazy so yesterday um i wanted to promote uh brooks so we're back to another sponsor now brooks um so what they've done is they've uh, um done a collab with chiquita bananas to um sort of give away some shoes it's a really cool thing i'll leave a link for it down below it's for sort of the benelux people so belgium and uh and the duchies so i'll leave it so i wanted to do some promotion for that so I'd been gifted, uh, or I swiped rather, from Brooks a uh, banana suit. So they use them. Uh, so bananas becoming sort of synonymous with uh, Brooks. It's a long story behind that, but yeah. So bananas, you often see them sort of on Brooks events. Someone dressed up as a, as a banana, and I had to do that on a weekend away with Brooks the other day. Uh, and I swiped it. I said, I want that suit, uh, with the intention of using it and sort of creating uh, some fun events and things. So I used it to cheer on people at a Friday evening race and that was a big success but yesterday I did a plug uh, the group plug so I dressed up as a banana man the attention that you get was just incredible you'll see that in the film uh, so now I've got the dilemma I think I now need to do that all the time it's just raises so much awareness and so much fun <sighs> There's a there's a um, a person on Instagram called uh, TPC Ashburn, so that's a trash pickup club Ashburn, and he always is dressing up, and he does brilliant films and clips and stuff. And I'll, I'll link to his account below, but uh, now I see why he does it. The the impact that you make is incredible. So I'm going to leave you with this film. Uh, next week I've got even more exciting news. So it's been a perfect storm for getting gifts. Um, so I've got a real big event that's um, been a year in the making from when my shed caught fire and I lost all my bikes. So next week I've got a huge post as well, video for you. So check that one out. So like and subscribe and all that stuff. But I'm gonna leave you with the, uh, the banana suit. Uh, am I gonna be doing a banana suit on a paddleboard? Let me get practice first with the, with the paddleboard. Then we'll see. Cheers.